What's up, everybody? Um, we are heading out to Summit Auto Lab, uh, Park City, to visit our boy Clayton. Uh, I3 is gone, and we replaced it with something else as a daily. And we're going to take that daily up, have uh, Clayton do the wrap on it. I think I'm going to help him. He probably doesn't want me to help him. Uh, so we're going to do that. And then, um, and then, I'll tell you what we bought. And uh, don't get too excited, because... It's not that cool. It's cool. It's fine. It's good. Anyway, it's just, uh, we'll jump into what it is and why after, but I'll show you the color first. How's that? Without giving too much away, this is the current color. be here in a minute but essentially there's just a couple of parts to disconnecting the engine and uh that so i already pulled out the seat we just have to i believe this way yeah we just disconnect the um numeric shifter linkage uh and then we're done inside the car so that's pretty easy so we'll do that next and then we will head on to bigger better things all right so that is disconnected uh, with that, we can, should be able to shut the doors and just jack it up and get to work underneath. Everything else is underneath. All right, so we are back in the garage. Cam is here to save the day. Uh, he told me one hour. <laughs> we know it's not going to be one hour, but hopefully we'll see how quick it is. We're going to time lapse it um and just see how we go technically two guys working on it for an hour that's two hours anyway my guess is oh, come, probably on. Be come on Brent. hour and a half three hours so uh, i don't need your help then fine <laughs> yeah all right <laughs> that's no help uh yeah so we'll get we'll get going on it but uh cam basically what what are we doing so yeah we just need to take off the fuel lines drain the oil um Unhook the, uh, this car does have a heater, so you have to unhook the heater um, tubes from the chassis. Mm -hmm. um, and then there's a couple of sensors on the transmission that you just have to unhook. And, okay. and it's really just four bolts, basically. Not too bad then. Yeah. So, uh, and should we mention that it's like 20 degrees? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, we like it cold here. I thought you were heating up the garage, right? <laughs> this, is, this is heated. <laughs> yeah, I believe it. This stuff here mm -hmm. um that stuff there like what wire goes to what on that you know because there's those three sensors okay So I don't know what we've done since the last time I was filming, but Cam is disconnecting, I believe, the sway bar. This is actually about how my safari build is going to look on this. Um, it's, Cam is scaring me. I just barely did those when we did the fuel lines like two months ago, so they have been loose. All right, so Cam, this is kind of the moment. So basically what we got to do now is... Um, just slowly start lowering it down and we have to pull it this way um, so that that uh, shifter will... Um, the linkage will slide through the rear bulkhead? Yeah, yeah exactly. Okay. But we just have to drop it low enough to get this bracket here. So all the bolts are off, everything's just sitting on the... Uh, right? Everything's just sitting on these now? Yeah. yeah. Oh boy. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> do we need to do you want me to check this for so just, once it gets below that bumper bar i start pulling back on it is the case it's you have like a millimeter right now yeah. Yeah. it's about to start jamming on that oh yeah it went right down looks like you cleared it cam's promising me a good time so i guess I'm about to get rowdy about to 
get rowdy. Cam, good job. We got it out. Looks like it's gonna be a, more of a pain to put in than to take out maybe, but <laughs> but we did it. So it's exciting. Um, remind me, you said don't lose the piece that you already put in over here. Yep. That's in. Uh, that is broken maybe, not the mm -hmm. shifter, but that. Yeah. Um, it's just a plug. That isn't um, attached to the fluid. <laughs> definitely want new axle bolts. New axle bolts. Those are the axle bolts uh, next to that. I need to bag those. Those are the motor mount bolts right next to it. Those two big ones with circle. Yeah, the small ones washers. are the motor mounts and the longer ones are the transmission mounts. Okay. So not a ton of bolts really, I guess, if we're looking at it. It's not too... Horrible. Yeah, um, a lot of connectors, you know. All right, well, Cam, thank you. We are both warm, and the project is basically done this part, so I appreciate it. The car is now very tall in the back, and we only almost tested that suspension from height once. Uh, so we are this close to coming off the jack, so we did okay. All right. <laughs> Thanks, dude. All right, so it's been a couple of days since we dropped off the uh, the daily driver uh, up at Summit Lab, Summit Auto Life Lab, Summit Life Lab, uh, and we are heading up to pick the car up. Um, I'm sure most of you, some of you have already figured out what we've got now, but uh, some of you have not. So uh, let's go drive to Park City and see what we can figure out. Go see Clayton, see how it turned out. Um, I've seen a couple of pictures, but I have not seen the car like done done yet. So pretty excited to see it and uh, yeah, let's go. And just like that, there's a blue car. Uh, I guess yeah. it's blue turquoise. What do you think? I would say yeah, bluish turquoise, light blue turquoise. Light bluish turquoise yep. is the color. So yes. yeah, I think that it actually looks pretty true to Miami blue. If you've seen Miami blue, Looks pretty good. Clayton, you are a master. Thank you so much. It looks yeah. so good. Yeah, it turned out really, really great. The car overall wasn't very difficult to wrap. It just took time, like okay. every wrap, yeah, disassembly and stuff. Yeah, I mean, I can't believe. When I was thinking about doing it, I was like, how much do I care if the F Sport badges are on it? You know, I was like, sure. yeah, I don't know if I'll put these back. But since you put them back, they look awesome. Yeah, they look great. <laughs> so, anyway, thank you so much. Definitely no appreciate it. Um, yeah, we'll be back for more. If you want this kind of stuff done, just order his swag instead, right? <laughs> you can send me a DM. Yeah, send him a DM. Yeah, that's it. All right, thanks, dude. Yeah, Appreciate no it. Later. Uh, so technically, we're in the past right now. This is what the car looked like before. Uh, yeah, there's Clayton doing Clayton stuff. Uh, yeah, so the car before blue, silver. I mean, it's a daily.